Okay, let's check. I heard if you search Wajangchi, Wajangchi on neighbor map. I'm really liking neighbor. I'm a neighbor guy. Yogi style. Okay, but kind of hurry. Hurry, kind of hurry. Let's go. I want to go. I want to go. I want to go. Let's try, try. Ah, that's right. Let's see. This is rush hour, right? Oh yes, almost like five-ish. Okay. Do you think there will be a long line? No. I hope so not. Maybe it's okay. It's gonna be a unique experience. Actually, yes, we do have like public toilet in Brazil, and it's not really clean and it's really small. So like, I have to ask someone like, can you shut the door for me? Because it's <laughs> not gonna shut down. Yeah. My mom always say, go to the bathroom at home before we go outside, so we don't need to go to like the public bathroom. So yes. I really like the bathrooms here in Korea. Like, I can feel safe to go because I know it's going to be clean. And a bit bigger. Yeah, yeah, and security of course. In Sweden, we have a lot of forest, so normally people do your business outside. Men and women. Oh my god. But do you do? Well, if I'm in a forest, of course. <laughs> if you're in a big city, like oh. for example, I live in Stockholm, and in Stockholm there is not a lot of forest, and there's a lot of public bathrooms. Those bathrooms generally are a bit smaller, very much more not clean. Yes. In Korea, it's very clean. In Korea, they have the you have the small right there in the the hole in the ground. For me, that's quite. Uh, that's too much, you know? yeah. like having to. Actually, yeah. I, I bet they seem like uh, it would be uh, yeah. more difficult. I tried once. <laughs> you did? Oh my god. <laughs> I was thinking, oh my god, what if I fell here and I die here? Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> I like public bathrooms here because I know it's going to be clean and I can do like... I agree. Yeah. I agree. It feels a lot more, like, a lot cleaner. The public bathrooms in Sweden, it's like a common thing. You only go to a public bathroom in Sweden if you really need to. I've been to one public bathroom before in a mall and it was so fancy. Like, yeah. you have no idea. It was like, like, neon lights in the roof and like, oh. it was super fancy. So, like, of course, the, the, the public bathroom here was uh, it was definitely very clean, super clean, super fresh, very big. Like there's so many people can go at once. Like the, the different. My different. first impression was like, oh my god, it's so cute and it's so clean. It's like wow, I never expect that because yeah. I mean it's a public toilet, I but agree. the light, even the light like around the mirror, it's like wow. I just feel like they say every time I go to the bathroom, I say go to the bathroom now, it's really clean. They say that's so Brazilian of me. <laughs> Because like, yeah, we don't really have clean bathrooms. I got so lost because I'm from a small city. The only subway station we have in Brazil is São Paulo and I live in the south and in the interior. So I'm from, I'm a cigar girl. <laughs> so it's really different. It was so horrible to get a, like a metro here. It was a lot of people. It was like really summer and it was so hot and everybody was stick together. And I couldn't transfer right away because I didn't know we need to transfer. It was so hard. I'm like, oh my God, what I'm going to do? I even got lost to get go home. So I just call a taxi and like getting me out of here. <laughs> My problem with the, the subway is my height. I'm 190, so I kind of feel out of place. Like, oh god, you just have to bow down to get on the subway. Oh but my other god. than that, it's uh, like the timetable, a lot of subways. It's so big. Like, it is like so many stations. How many stations are there? It would take like uh, two years to discover every station. Like, the subway is very cheap. Compared to Sweden, it's very cheap. It's the price same price well. in Brazil. It's very safe. It depends if you, like, if now there's curfews. And if you travel during the curfews, there's a lot of drunk people, I've noticed. But I mean, I've always been safe. Like, there's never been a, been a reason to not feel safe, I think. So, yeah. 